got time right now? All right, then. with the Phantom Thieves. It's open. Welcome. Excuse me. It was nothing.
Wait. Cool. 
Come on, man. Let's get started. Ooh, we can do this! I didn't have time to study everything. I probably could have managed if I had an extra week, too. An extra week, huh? The only... Oh, you mean like... I heard the school moved her exam period. Hey, congrats on survival. Say, there's... It sure has... Get back to actually sleeping in peace. Hmm. Nah. I'm... I know, right? I kept a clean. You two are. Pr <sighs> and I can only. Ima Whatever. It's over with now. Who cares about that anymore? What's real important is the Phantom Thieves' popularity. <laughs> Ain't it amazing? It kind of feels like our time's finally. I've even heard people excitedly speculating about our next target. You will have to choose carefully. There's no need to hurry. We should spend some time thinking it over. Hold up! The most important thing now is our celeb- I hope you guys didn't forget. It's the fireworks festival on the 18th. I guess we're good meeting up. We should- So it barely even
back. What did you say? Think of it. Hey, hey. Right one. Just add this.
you want to do? Let me explain. All right. Yes. All right. What? Tell me. Ugh, no way. We were busy. Hey, it's not my fault my school. You don't gotta throw the truth right in my face like that. Anyways, there's something more important here. Mishima. You wanna ask me something about the internet, right? Yep. I'm gonna be straight with you here. Do you know who Medjet is? <laughs> you weren't kidding about being direct. Well, I suppose the news about Medjet and the Phantom Thieves has caused quite the commotion. They started out as hackers of justice. But now, they only look out for their own self-interests. That's all I know. They were the group I texted him about yesterday. I see. Nobody's sure who actually belongs to Medjet. Well, it looks like things will be exciting this summer. It'll be the Phantom Thieves' world debut, no? Dude. Don't worry. I'll be rooting for the Phantom Thieves. I'll get the forum mobilized as well. Now, if we're done talking here, I really must be going. I'll see you guys later. So... I wonder if anyone else got any info. No luck. Medjet, huh? It seems like we won't be able... Settled. We've had many strange incidents. Hence, Principal Kobayakawa has instructed... Well, this is inconvenient for us, too, you know. Having to find things to warn you about so suddenly. This stuff's really not going so good. Clues on Medjet, huh? Hmm. I'll just add this.
Reminds me. Thank you very much. All right. Hey. We still don't have
You got the heart of an enthusiast. <laughs> You're a strange one, kid. Wait a sec. <laughs> yeah, this could work. Hey, I can grant that wish of yours, but you better have the money. These things are worth hundreds of thousands of yen per unit. Sometimes they even reach the millions, depending on how I feel. Look, I ain't a bad dude. I've been known to compromise from time to time. For example, you help me out with my business. Smuggling goods, destroying evidence, and as a reward, I'll introduce you to the special menu. With good prices for a punk like you. What do you say? Not bad, huh? That's on a need-to-know basis and you don't need to know. Gotta fight evil with evil. I need a pawn of my own. Don't talk to no one about this. Got it? Just follow my orders. Now what's it gonna be? That's fine. Okay, I'll work on that special menu for you. You should be grateful. It seems you had model guns in your possession as well. Their detail goes beyond a simple hobby. I'm sure some people believed those guns were real. You'll tell me how you procured them, won't you? Spill it! I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the hanged man persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. When I don't got any business going on, I'll have you do some miscellaneous chores. Must be pretty exciting for an enthusiast like you, huh? Hey! Seems you've got your share of problems, inmate. To think you would relax under such circumstances. Either you're quite bold, or quite foolish. One with an unseen form, hmm. It seems you've been targeted by troublesome company. <laughs> I've been enjoying this endless dispute over justice. However, 
It will soon come to an end, and through the appearance of an unexpected force of all things. Engaging with formidable enemies is also part of your rehabilitation. I ask that you overcome this. After all, you must hone your powers and become a magnificent thief. It's really summer now. I get sweaty just walking a little bit. I didn't think Medjed would pounce on the Phantom Thieves. Interesting things keep happening this year. The influence of the Phantom Thieves knows no bounds. I underestimated it, honestly. I wonder what the public thinks of this. Are they entertained? Or perhaps inconvenienced? Entertained, huh? A luxury for the uninvolved. I know they mean no ill intent. So this is what the public thinks. Oops. I don't have time for a conversation. My attendance has been poor due to interviews lately. Thank you for your valuable opinion. I'll see you around. I don't get it. Teammates pulling a prank. Shouldn't you respond to? Fly back. I don't know what this is all about, but we should probably let everyone know about this. Considering he mentioned stealing hearts, he knows, doesn't he? Seems so. How were we found out? He may have traced our chat log. How careless of us. But how would he have known all these details with just that? Do you think that there is another cause? Yeah. I'm not sure why, but that's the feeling I get. Hey, is it that easy to look at someone else's chat log? I don't know much about it myself, but... Probably not impossible, I think. How's it done? Maybe they extracted our phone's data? Why is he getting an error when he tries to reply? Perhaps the receiving end doesn't exist. That's possible? Don't ask me everything. I told you that I don't know much about it. Wait. Might this be what is referred to as hacking? Then, does that mean this guy's a hacker? I don't get high-tech stuff. What does this all mean? An unknown hacker contacted us. I see. I don't really get it. Then, is this person Mejed? I doubt it. Considering he says he wants to deal with them. That is, only if we take his words for face value. True. Hey, wouldn't it be great if we got this guy on our side? But we know nothing about his identity at all. We can't trust him. I don't think it's a bad deal, though. Even if Alibaba turns out to be a criminal, I am not helping anyone of that sort. Oh, right. That wouldn't be good. The I've prepared the necessary tool part makes no sense either. Could this just be a prank? He knows an awful lot for it to be a prank. If he knows who we are, 
Won't we get caught? No, if he wanted to report us, I think he would have done it already. He must have some sort of objective of his own. He did offer us a deal after all. I'm certain he'll contact us again. There's no telling when he'll do so, though. It'd be best if we stay together. If something happens, we can act at once. Yeah, so somewhere we can wait and hide for long hours. How about LeBlanc? with a big group good evening we were thinking about putting together plans for our summer hmm is that a new face I see it's nice to meet you my name is Makoto Nijima I hope we're not being a bother she's our student council president Nijima is something wrong no it's nothing a student council president eh? <laughs> I'm stunned I hope he's not causing you too much trouble. I'm Sojiro Sakura, but everyone just calls me boss. By the way, that was addressed to you. Uh, this old man will get going and leave you kids be. All right, the store's all yours. We have late breaking news on Medjit, whose notoriety rose since their statement the other day. Just moments ago, a new message has been released on their website. They have announced their victory over the Phantom Thieves. Medjit also warns any Japanese citizens who praised the Phantom Thieves to stop doing so. We will report any further actions by Medjit as they arrive. Oh, come on! It's in English! Let me see. The Phantom Thieves remain silent at our question. This proves that we are just. People of Japan, wake up. You must not worship the Phantom Thieves. What? That's bullshit! Keep listening. We will discipline any who worship them. The punishment is the confiscation of possessions. We are Medjed. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. That's what it says. What does that all mean? They're saying that they'll target sympathizers of the Phantom Thieves. Confiscation of possessions, hmm? Perhaps bank accounts or personal information? Either way, it won't be anything pleasant. Why the hell are we being singled out? Perhaps all they care about is labeling the Phantom Thieves as crooks. That all this wouldn't have happened had the Phantom Thieves not existed. That's complete bullshit! Talk about a troublesome organization that we've been targeted by. Isn't there anything we can do? It's certain we can't do anything about this on our own. Hey, so what's this letter about? I don't need any more trouble. It's rare for you to get something like this. A calling card? Anything else in there? Who's this from, anyway? There's no stamp on it. Someone must have directly dropped it into the mailbox here. Could it have been Alibaba? That reminds me. He did mention something about preparing the necessary tool. Don't tell me. Is this what he was talking about? What the hell's going on here? All we can do at the moment is wait for Alibaba's orders. Let's brace ourselves and stand by. In case anything comes up. Oh dear.
He can look forward to whatever he wants. We have no means of striking back against Medjed. We're gonna be in deep trouble if we don't do something. Good morning. <sighs> so anyway... He threatened you, then just took Sakura? In any case, we should... We're gonna get reported if we don't do this? What the hell? The Taba Sakura? Wasn't Sakura... It's Boss's last name! Does he have any family? Does he? Reels? How laid back are you? Wouldn't you normally be introduced at least? I mean, you are living in. Well, his situation does make things difficult. The calling card was delivered to Boss's house. It'd be more natural to assume this is all related. One of the reasons for that is because Alibaba mentioned nothing about which Futaba Sakura. Perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough. That makes sense. I believe it's adequate for us to think that this is the doing of someone close by. I see. I don't know how Alibaba got a hold of his smartphone information. However, since he's ordering us through chat, I do feel as though he's taunting us. You mean, this might just be a prank? I mean, look at his demands. Pay me if you don't want me to leak who you really are. That I'd understand. But he's telling us to steal someone's heart without explaining why. So we're being tested. Regardless, I think we should ask Boss about Futaba Sakura once. That's probably for the best. There's nothing else we can do at the moment, and Chief might have an idea on what this is about, too. I'll check the school's roster just in case. 
We must make sure Boss doesn't figure out who we are. We'll have to go about this cautiously. Hmm? What's up? Why do you know about that? Hmm. It's got nothing to do with you. I'm going home. Make sure you lock up the place. Looks like it's a hit. What are your thoughts? Tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but we still got all this lame shit coming up. If you don't take care of this lame shit, you can kiss your summer vacation goodbye. Oh yeah, about this Futaba Sakura girl. If she's related to Boss, think people living nearby would know about her? That's some keen intuition coming from you, Ryuji. You should have made use of that on your exams. Uh, I never want to think about exams ever again. Anyway... Asking around in your neighborhood might be the fastest way to figure this shit out. And again, I doubt it'll be that easy. It never is.
So, up until now, our biggest lead seems to be... The Chief buys a lot of food. Far more than enough for one person living alone. Let's check out all the shops where you can buy food. This place... Hey there, welcome. Hmm, Futaba? Over at Sakura-san's? I haven't heard anything. Uh, sorry, come again. Hmm. I think our only option now is to go home and... <sighs> you read the letter, did you not? So you're the one who tipped him off about Futaba. You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you about Wakaba. Tipped off? What are you talking about? Back to the matter at hand. Your parental authority will have to be suspended. I take it you're okay with that outcome? What? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points in your favor. Would you like to take this to domestic court? Our chances of victory are roughly 99.9% .9 though. With these suspicions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. You're going that far? I told you I don't know a damn thing about it! We're extremely serious about this. As long as there's a possibility that cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns. Fine. You win. Thank you. I will contact you at a later date. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. That's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will just be for a nice cup of coffee. And stay out! That woman is real good at pissing people off. What's with that look? You got something to say? This doesn't involve you. That's enough. Just behave yourself. Keep going to school if you don't want me to throw you out of here. You got that? Lock the store up. Well, that basically confirms Futaba exists, at least. But it sounds like she's got her own problems. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive something? I wonder what the Chief's hiding. We can't really press him on the subject, though. Especially after he mentioned throwing you out. fashion magazine when you dress like a fashion victim. Because I really like words and pants. Nice. I see. Hmm. Well then. A woman was threatening boss? Yeah. She was going on about domestic abuse and taking the case to court and stuff. Oh. What's up? It's nothing. So to summarize what you told us, Futaba is boss's daughter, and he's abusing her? I don't know him very well. Is he really the kind of person who would do that? I would like to believe so as well, but... We don't have any conclusive evidence, do we? Is it Alibaba? What a self. 
Well, he does have information on us. Anyways, this Futaba he's talking about have a palace? If try messaging him. What are we supposed to do? We'd be able to figure out Alibaba's identity if we could just try asking him if there's any way we could meet up. He can't go out? Not only can Alibaba not go out, but he won't let us meet Futaba either. Well, it's none of our business now. But what do we do about Medjed? We won't be able to get Alibaba to help us with them now. Maybe they were just pranking us. They made that huge declaration, but they ain't done nothing since. <laughs> I bet we got them. You mean they backed out because they're afraid we'll change their hearts? Yep. And now it'd just make them look lame if they came out and apologized. But... I guess with Alibaba and Medjet out of the picture, can we just say this case is closed? You do have a point. Oh yeah! Remember Kanashiro's treasure? Prepare to have your minds blown! We got 150,000 yen out of it! That's awesome! We can really go all out with that kind of money! Yeah! Let's make up for what happened at the fireworks festival! Gotta go eat something fitting for the Phantom Thieves' worldwide debut! Where would be good? Ooh, how about sushi? I could really go for some eel, too. The best method is to fill yourself on ginger before beginning to eat sushi. That is my master technique. You don't need to do that this time. Actually, definitely don't do it, okay? I'm all for sushi! You're okay with that too, right? Nope. I want sushi. All right. We'll go tomorrow night. Nice. I should write something. 